All right, what's up guys? Welcome back. Today, I wanted to basically show you guys a really cool resource that I found. I'll leave a link to the site in the description down below. It's called pokemmo.netlafly.app, something like that. Um, yeah, this is a really solid website. I just want to walk you guys through a couple of things. Um, first off, uh, there's like tons of guides that basically like when you click on like read more, for instance, like simply explained alphas, if you want to just read about alphas, it'll take you to a forum site that basically exactly tells you, you know, what an alpha is, how long it lasts. Um, it's very useful, very, very good stuff. So that's the first thing. There's a ton of guides out here. Um, you can load more, obviously. There's um, there's like what, eight or so like right here that are just like some of the biggest ones and then from the like from the forums you can actually go to um, other guides and and you'll see that kind of stuff um, as well as just a like, quick info here this is really cool regions level cap this is just like a lot of useful information in terms of like you know what your most high level Pokemon can be based on the region <clears throat> it's been a long time since I played these regions so I actually didn't know like Sinnoh uh, like you had a higher like 27 than, than 24 for most of them and uh, like yeah it's it's pretty cool you know just a lot of s stuff like that amulet coin earnings um you get like the multiplier depending on you know how much you can earn per gym um yeah just a lot of useful information ev utility these are like the best ev spots for each region um that's actually very useful i might make like a video on this i don't know i've never tried like this amunga spot for instance um, this Machoke spot, Celio spot, Gloom. Um, yeah, it's it's very useful, very, very interesting stuff per region, as well as this upcoming events. Uh, there's like, it tells you when catch events are coming up. So if I clicked on like this, this heart shaped shenanigans, uh, that's gonna be on April 29th, it looks like. Um, and this is gonna be a love disc event. That's, that's really cool. I think that there should be an event on Thursday. Um, these are like PVP events, but I thought there was a catch event on Thursday. I'm not sure why it's not showing up here, but either way, um, yeah, it's it's really cool. You know, basically it tells you what the upcoming events are gonna be. That's really dope. But I think like the main thing for me, what's really cool is this. It's called the breeding simulator. Um, this basically tells you how much you're gonna need to spend for how many IVs you want. So about 65,000, you might need four Pokemon. And basically like from the price calculations, it tells you like, how worth it or not a breed is going to be so you could like plug in different stuff um and uh for instance let's just say defense or something like that start breeding um and it'll tell you you know it basically just gives you this little chart of what you'll need to come out with what you want exactly um yeah sixty five thousand. if you want four ivs it's going to be 155,000, and five ivs 340,000. so yeah a lot of useful information there um, the Pokédex is a huge one. This is a really, really useful information because if you want to sort by Horde, for instance, and then say uh, you only had Hoenn done, you could see exactly which Pokémon are hoardable. So say this Machop. Say I really wanted a Machop, and Focus Band is actually a really good item. Um, and I just click this. It tells you exactly where it is. Jagged Pass in the grass at 18 to 20. Like it tells you exactly where it is. Um, that's awesome. It tells you, <clears throat> excuse me, the catch rates as well. So full HP got 30% chance, uh, one HP and a sleep. It's a hundred percent chance to catch with a pokeball, like really cool stuff. It tells you the stats of each Pokemon. You know, it's, it's obviously attack and HP heavy for this Machop. Um, just so much information. Obviously it tells you like the held items for a lot of these Pokemon as well. The location is big. Um, and that's awesome. You know, you can check out the special types, for instance, like Feebas is, is in Hoenn. Uh, let's see, it's anything in Sinnoh? Uh, Unova has a couple of specials as well, it looks like. <clears throat> um, I'm guessing, yeah, yeah, because Unova is, uh, is what's it called? Finos, I guess. Um, yeah, nothing in Kanto, one in Hoenn, nothing in Sinnoh. Um, let's see what else you can do. Uh, you can check by lures. Uh, so you know, you can get, figure out where to get Polyrath from, you know, Polyraths are in lures apparently now, I didn't even know this, but they apparently added a lot more Pokemon to lures, Crobat is in, excuse me, in lures, Politoed, Scizor, Kingdra, Gardevoir is in lures, like, it's really cool, you know, the amount of information, Brelooms, um, as well as, you know, 
what level they come in and, and what route they're in. That's awesome. You know, so much useful information here. You can like look up exactly what you're looking for uh, inside of stuff, caves, water, you know, a lot of cool stuff. You can you can clear it. You can just open up catch rates or stats for every single Pokemon as well. Awesome stuff. Awesome stuff. I really like this Pokedex. Um, it just talks about egg moves. So say Ivysaur, like these are the egg moves that, that you'd need for, um, for certain Pokemon. I personally don't have a whole lot of use for this at the moment, but you can see why this would be effective. Uh, cosmetics Helper. This is cool because you can basically just check like and you can basically just look at like exactly like how you want your your character to be so just let me just you know just put stuff up here um just gonna put in some like random stuff um <clears throat> and boom like if you wanted your pokemon to look like this like this is what it would look like it's, it's kind of cool you know you can see how um certain like hats would look uh with with different stuff there's let's see the uh i think the golden dragon mask that's something that i would like eventually want to go for um you can see how it looks with like the sleigh, um, maybe the top, maybe you got like a, I don't know, a bones uniform, for instance, like it would look something like that, you know, it, it'd be so cool. It would be so cool. There's also like a randomized button where you can like diff try out different stuff and just see like, oh, this looks kind of cool. You know, a green eyeball mask. Um, he's holding something. There's a torch, right? Uh, some people hold like a lollipop or a shadow bone club. Like it's, it's pretty dope. Um, so that's really cool. The cosmetics helper. Uh, going back home here, the last thing up is a berries helper. <clears throat> now, personally, I don't use a lot with berries, so I don't know, uh, you know, how to handle a whole lot of this, the berry stuff. But you can tell um, exactly the grow time, how many you get, uh, what you need, the plant button. Like if you tell, if, if you say plant, it'll it'll actually like give a countdown timer for you, you know, so you can kind of keep track in this way. So say I wanted to plant. Uh, Lepa berries. I'm going to have to find Lepas. I don't think this is alphabetical. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Lepa berry. Lepa berry. Here you go. Say I wanted to plant Lepa berries. Um, <clears throat> they'd be ready in 20 hours. Um, I need to check on like when I water them and all that kind of stuff. If I watered them, it, it would it would show in the status here. Really cool stuff, you know. So very very useful. Um, yeah, man. You can write your own guide. Load more guides. A lot of different guides that, that I plan on making videos on using this website uh, certain builds as well so yeah man really good website really useful I, I definitely highly recommend y'all check this out uh, the big thing for me is the pokedex you know checking what Pokemon hold what items where they are like it's it's really cool you know exactly where they are like obviously this stuff is in the game but um, it's just kind of nice to have it all at one place, you know, seeing that an Absol at one, uh, one HP is like still like a 39% chance catch rate. Like it's crazy, you know, crazy, crazy stuff. But yeah, that's basically it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you did make sure to leave a like and subscribe again, I'll leave a link to this, this website in the description down below, but hopefully you did enjoy this. I will definitely see you guys in a future video. And until then, hope you guys have a great rest of the day, rest of the week. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace, peace, and peace.